In a distant star system, a highly advanced extraterrestrial civilization flourished. Their technology was thousands of years ahead of humanity's, with mastery over energy, space travel, and the manipulation of entire ecosystems. The extraterrestrial civilization had long explored the cosmos, not for conquest, but to subtly guide the development of other civilizations, ensuring that none would surpass them. Upon discovering Earth in the early stages of human civilization, they observed with interest, as humans began to develop primitive forms of governance and technology, the extraterrestrial civilization devised a long-term strategy, infiltration and subtle control. Rather than wage a war, they decided to insert themselves into Earth's political and economic structures, ensuring that humanity would never reach its full potential. Phase 1. Infiltration. Over centuries, the extraterrestrial civilization sent covert agents to Earth, appearing as ordinary humans, but possessing abilities to manipulate minds and emotions. They infiltrated powerful positions, monarchs, political leaders, religious figures, and economic magnates. The extraterrestrial civilization knew that controlling a society's leadership would allow them to dictate its direction. As human empires rose and fell, the extraterrestrial agents ensured that technological and societal progress occurred, but at a deliberately slow pace. Breakthroughs in energy production, such as early forms of sustainable energy or advanced mechanics, were stifled through economic control and sabotage. Inventors who got too close to revolutionary discoveries were either marginalized, bought off or murdered by those in power who were unknowingly manipulated by the extraterrestrial civilization. Phase 2. Energy and Technology Suppression In the 20th century, as human ingenuity accelerated, the extraterrestrial agents intensified their efforts. Fossil fuels, a finite and environmentally destructive resource, became the backbone of global energy production. Cleaner, more sustainable energy technologies, nuclear fusion, solar, and even early concepts of zero-point energy were shelved or deliberately discredited. The extraterrestrial agents in key positions ensure that oil magnates and energy companies became more powerful, further entrenching humanity's dependence on outdated energy sources. Any technology that could free society from this dependence was systematically suppressed, either through corporate lobbying, misinformation campaigns, or the manipulation of public opinion. Phase 3. Stalling Space Exploration The extraterrestrial civilization viewed humanity's burgeoning interest in space exploration as a threat. By the mid-20th century, humans began to look to the stars with hope of expansion. The space race resulted in the moon landing, but extraterrestrial agents quickly moved to halt further progress. Budgets for space programs were slashed, Missions beyond Earth's orbit were stalled, and public interest waned as governments focused on more terrestrial concerns. Behind the scenes, key political leaders, swayed by extraterrestrial influence, claimed that the cost of space exploration was too high, or that Earth's problems needed to be solved before humanity could venture into the cosmos. All the while, extraterrestrial technology ensured that space exploration remained just out of reach for humans, stalling their progress. Phase 4. The Mechanism of Money and Control One of the most insidious extraterrestrial tactics was the manipulation of human economies through the creation of complex financial systems. The modern banking system, central banks, and the concept of debt-based economies were all subtly influenced by extraterrestrial agents. By controlling the flow of money and resources, the extraterrestrial civilization ensured that entire societies could be manipulated. Debt became a powerful tool of control. Governments and corporations borrowed heavily, chaining them to financial institutions that dictated global policies. The result was a system where people worked endlessly, not for true progress or the betterment of society but to service debts and sustain the unsustainable. The pursuit of material wealth became the focus of humanity, stifling scientific exploration, cultural development, 
and meaningful societal progress. Phase 5. Controlling Human Development As the 21st century progressed, human societies became more fractured and distracted. Populations were pacified with consumerism, entertainment, and division, all while the true levers of power were pulled by the extraterrestrial civilization. Social media and technology were encouraged, but only insofar as they kept humanity distracted and divided. Scientific advancement in key areas like medicine, space travel, and sustainable living remained stagnant or moved in directions that served extraterrestrial interests. Any humans who attempted to expose the truth about energy manipulation, political corruption, or the potential for greater space exploration were silenced or discredited. Misinformation campaigns orchestrated by extraterrestrial controlled media ensured that any truth was buried beneath a mountain of noise and confusion. The end game. By 2050, humanity had reached a standstill. Political systems were paralyzed by infighting, economies were crippled by debt, and environmental crises grew ever worse as humanity continued to rely on fossil fuels. Space exploration was little more than a nostalgic dream, and the once promising future of human innovation seemed a distant memory. The extraterrestrial civilization had succeeded in their mission. By controlling key positions in Earth's leadership, they had ensured that humanity would never reach the stars, never challenge their dominance, and never realize their full potential. The extraterrestrial civilization did not seek to destroy humans, but to keep them contained, a species forever bound by their own limitations, unaware of the invisible hand guiding their fate. In the shadows, the extraterrestrial civilization observed their hand work, knowing that, as long as they held the reins of power, humanity's destiny would remain firmly under their control.